Hello guys, I'm Dr. Nero today I'm going to show you how to add interactive mouse move background effect with an easiest way. So first of all guys, if you don't uh, subscribe uh, this channel yet, then please go and uh, click this red button and make subscribe our channel and then after that press that bell icon to watch every up update from Tutorial Sport and uh, never miss any new trick and any new video from us. So let's get start. So here this is uh, this is the demo we have, which we will build on this tutorial. So here you can see this is um, this is looking very uh, nice or very pretty when I'm my, when I'm going to uh, move my mouse on the on the screen. So this is a look very pretty and very uh, interactive for your user. So you can build this uh, type of section or type of header for your web page also. Here I have used uh, here I am using three layer uh, and that and that three of uh, uh, layer will be in background and one layer will be on uh, fr uh, front side which is contain tutorial support. So let's start with the HTML part first. So here you can see these are the layers of background three background layers and uh, one is overlay layer which will be standing in front of front one so let's uh, start with background layer so here these are the three layer where uh, has class image one image two image three and one common class which has layer and another thing which will con consist in HTML part is the overlay section this overlay section will be uh, will be present in front of all of the uh, all of layer so let's start with css so this is the image one css here i will set image one as a uh, Amazon background url one dot png then set z index one and opacity gives 0 0.4 and make blur three pixel and this whole things will has diff four in different different browsers then uh, add background sizes and cover and background position as in center then background repeat as in no repeat and then transformation translate 3d has x y and z axis has zero as a default and then transformation style has a preserve 3d so it will be style as a 3d then uh, in image 2 i have mm, two thing is different one is the uh, background url and one is the z index 2 the other thing are same as in one and uh, yeah also in image 2 there is no an opacity so i have used as a uh, one and image 3 have used as a 0 0.5 opacity and z index equal to 3 so it will be on last of our uh, sorry uh, first on background okay so this whole thing will be same after the transformations and translate 3d all that and this is the uh, overlay uh, section which is uh, which consists our text image whatever you want to uh, present on our front view so in that overlay we have z index equal to 5 so it will be front in all of uh, all of us all of that sorry layer okay so this is a whole css which is uh, for an email yeah we have forgot this layer id so this layer has a uh, content box as in box sizing and padding and margin as i have given 50 pixels and 200 pixels is to open that so you can give as your wish there is no matter okay so then after that I move to javascript part so first of all you have to add your jquery plugin here i have added this for this from this link and after that we have stored that image 1 image 2 image 3 and overlay container into several separate variables like here i have done that image 2, 2 image 1 and image 3 has a variable name then i then we have start a function with an overlay dot mouse move function e which when overlay has on overlay when we going to mouse move at the time that function will be run and then then two variable which is the amount move x and amount move y will be stored and within this different value when this uh, this value will be e page x into minus 1 upon 12 
so for an image uh, image 2 we have use minus 1 by 12 it means it, means it will be uh, multiply with an minus 1 by 12 and then add with an current position which is 0 0 0 we, we have we have uh, defaultly uh, defaultly mentioned in our uh, CSS so here you can see that the 0 0 0 so after this this image 2 dot css will be say, um, will be changed with an addition of uh, current x or current y into minus 1 by 12 okay so this changes will be done in x and y axis only the uh, z index will be 0 as the default let's take it change uh, and uh, let's see what will happen if we make it a uh, larger change on this i think there is no any uh, there is a make change but we can't see this change on uh, desktop because it will be changed on z index and we can't see uh, changes on z index in desktop so here you can see there is uh, nothing different we can find we can if we going to uh, add add that 10 pixels on z axis so this is the same which is uh, before so uh, there is nothing going to change and this is the for only image 2 okay so this function will run uh, for an image 2 and now we have to move to an for an another background okay so another background is an image 1 and, the, and that image will be uh, change their position with an current position into minus 1 by 1 by 18 plus that current position so this is the changes will be going to happen with an image 1 and that same thing will be this whole coding for an uh, JavaScript and uh, for an making interactive mouse move effect if you guys have any query or question please comment down it below and thanks for watching please if you like then hit that like button and and share to others and subscribe our channel for an more video and uh, please guys do it fast